In the former Soviet Republic Ukraine, controversial video has surfaced showing the reburial of Ukrainians who fought for an SS division during World War II. And the reburial was sanctioned by church officials and overseen by officials dressed in Nazi uniforms. Ethnic Ukrainian nationalists wore helmets with swastikas and uniforms marked with Third Reich eagles during the service for 16 members of the SS Division Galicia. The ceremony took place in the village of Holohori in Ukraine's western Lviv province. Some veterans were present. During a salute over the grave, costumed reenactors used wartime-era rifles to fire a salute as their leader gave commands in German. Priests looked on, and later in the ceremony, Oleg Pankevich, a member of parliament for the political party Svoboda, which has a faction in parliament, called on Ukrainians to stand up as a nation and to resist outside oppression. The SS division Galicia is controversial in Ukraine because it was drawn from the west of the country, which is mainly populated by ethnic Ukrainians, many of whose grandfathers fought on the side of Germany during World War II. The east and the south of Ukraine is heavily Russian-speaking, and during World War II, both ethnic Russians and Ukrainians from those regions fought in the Red Army for the Soviet Union. And that is why wartime loyalty remains a political flashpoint in modern Ukraine. Svoboda, which means freedom in Ukrainian, is led by the nationalist politician Oleg Tanybok. The group has seen increasing popularity in recent years with a political platform of proud Ukrainian nationalism and an end to Soviet-style leadership, crony capitalism and political corruption. But Svoboda has drawn fire for an alleged unwillingness to admit ethnic Russians and other non-Ukrainian nationalities into its ranks and for anti-Semitic comments by some of its functionaries. The party has also been criticized for strong-arm tactics, as shown here when Svoboda activists fought with police to break into a Kiev city council meeting they had been locked out of.